Hello everyone. Today I'm back with my uh, new purchase. This is the um, own vintage um, Louis Vuitton Noé or Noir. Um, I watched the um, video um, unboxing video from Trina, and she said that the um, sale associate from Louis Vuitton called this one is the um, the uh, Noir, not Noé as we only call this. So I very excited to know that, and um, I wanted to show you my um, little little review of my new vintage handbag. Um, I love this bucket style bag very much, and um, once I saw the um, advertising from Louis Vuitton that the uh, mini trend pack bag is coming back with this no way. I really really um, couldn't get it out of my head and I think that I, I should get it before um, it's gonna fading out or uh, I mean the classic one is not but um, anyway you know what I mean here is my um, detail shot on my bag and here is the uh, sneak, sneak peek of inside. So here of all the um, stuff I have right now in my bag. Okay, I will get into it in a minute, but um, just want to show you the detail of my handbag. This one is quite old, I think. It's about more than 15 years or maybe 20 years um, but I think it's quite good condition to compare with the age like um, you can see some dust mark in this one of the bottom of the bag but it's not so bad and um, I'm okay with it because um, it's it's a vintage piece and as I use it, it's gonna get dust anyway so um, and I don't think I'm planning to sell this bag anyway so it's okay for me and uh, inside of my bag because I'm carrying it um, since the day I got it um, so um, here's what inside of my bag this bag is really roomy I have to say um, I think uh, to choose between this one and the Neverphone, I prefer this kind of style because I think the opening is quite um, safe here to compare with the Neverphone. I used to have the Neverphone before and um, I don't really, don't really like it. Um, so I sold it. Um, but this one is really, um, really nice, really interesting. Um, just quickly go through my bag um, I have the magazine here that I try to catch up like I only got the new magazine but um, I never can finish it it's on time so it's just on my my desk for a while until I have the time to get into it and like I carry it in my bag and I read it while I'm waiting for the bus or the train or something and here is my makeup bag the makeup in the kind of like toiletry inside 15 but I don't think it is a toiletry I think um, it's the small pochette that you attack in the bucket bag for a long time ago um, this is my agenda as you can see in the last video this is my vintage um, Chanel wallet um, the French style I really really love this wallet I I have to say that I'm really impressed with the um, the quality of um, Chanel wallet I only think it's too soft to be um, to to be a wallet for use I mean the Chanel one because I saw so many beat up Chanel wallet but this one is really really good wallet um, also my glee if you know is my key clay and also my compound here and my hand cream 
Neutrogena is the best, I think. If you really have like sensitive skin that easy to to dry out, that is the best one you can get to recover your hand skin. Um, for normal moisturizer, you don't need it that thick. But um, I mean, for for a really bad bad skin um, damage, this one is really good. And I have the little um, hand sanitizer. Okay, here's my bag overall. I normally take my bag out um, without tightening it up. I think it's not necessary. As I say, the um, the opening quite big, but you also can control it by the um, the tire. So it's not um, it's not unsafe or anything. So. That's all. That's my quick video for my new Noe or Noah. Thanks for watching. See you soon.